touching the truth. So Roblox Skyblock has just released a new update that has devastated thousands of its players because now you got oily onions. Well, of course, I got clean onions, but I'll tell you how you can get clean onions too. You don't have to break your farms, just like Mayra Shart and Jesse Games have been saying. They've been telling every single one of their fans to break their farms to make this new farm that's super hard to get, and you need a lot of propellers. Now, of course, I have another propeller in my inventory, and also have an industrial washing station, which is pretty cool. And I'm going to be showing you how you can set it up easily. You don't have to break any of your farms. And by the way, shout out to I believe Krabby Patty 200 for helping me with my totems. I now got a bunch of them back, so I'm not that scammed. All I need to do is just fix this part. Uh, Nairo will help me with that, and our onion farm is almost done with its fourth layer. And I actually sacrificed some workbenches for crystallized iron because crystallized iron is pretty useful. Oh, and by the way, I got a, two more pearls, so now I can make two washing stations, but I won't do that because I already have an industrial one and I also have a propeller. But anyway, Anyway, today I'm going to be showing you how you can set up your farm. You don't have to break it. You literally just have to make just an attachment. So many of you guys might have farms like me where it's a bunch of layers. You might have the pyramid farm where it all drops in into one space or you might have the triangle farm where it also drops into one space. The important thing is that it drops into one space because once it drops into that one space, you can easily fix it with this method. So as you can see, I'm going to... Oh my goodness as you can see it's not the most perfect one because you got a lot of oily onions that are still here but you know it just helps you a lot because like my onions are still doing really really well um if you don't like this idea you can go check out other youtubers but this is pretty much the ideal uh farm making for me as you can see it is washing my plants perfectly well so i'm going to break this and i'm going to show you exactly how you can replicate what i did so many of you guys might have farms like this probably without this mothsy stone block and it just pours in oily onions of course you would also need walls over here but now you guys are devastated with these ugly little Ew stuff, they're disgusting. So all you need to do is just follow these steps. So first of all, break your industrial chest and clog up your uh, source of onions. So yeah, I'm going to leave those no, they give me like OCD because they're disgusting. So I'm going to pick these up. So once you have uh, picked up everything and done that, all you need is just two coal totems, one at each side. You don't need any more, any less, because if you have any more, it might clog up your industrial washing machine. So just two is perfect. It's the perfect number. And the next thing is getting your beautiful industrial washing machine. So you're going to go over here and place it down just like any regular thing. The th cool thing about the washing machine is you can actually place blocks uh, so let's go over and use some stone you can place blocks next and onto it as you can see they're kind of merged together um, that's uh, something that the totems and I believe the smelter cannot do so that is one cool thing about the washing machine I'm going to clog it up because you know what I'm not gonna clog it up because I'm big flex I, I want to just show everybody my washing machine now the thing is uh, so once the coal starts pouring in as you can see the washing machine has enough coal and then I'm going to place this here and all you need is your chest as a source and then you're going to just going to place it there. Um, I'm also going to be showing you guys a video on how you can get propellers uh, coming out right after this video. So you guys be sure to smash like and hit notifications. We're almost on our road to 300 subscribers. So yeah, smash like and stuff like that. Um, then you're going to clog up this part in case it just spews out. And that's pretty much it. That's literally all you got to do. Um, the onions may overfill, so I'm going to just do that. Um, but I really want people to see my washing machine, so I'm going to do that. You know, that's why not. Oh gosh, there's stone there. Disgusting. And there we go. That is 
pretty much all you need to make for your farm. I think I kind of renovated it, but that's all you need to do. And you're going to be getting fresh onions as soon as possible. All you need to do is just mine out this thing and all the onions will fall out. Boom, chicka, boom. Now it might clog up, so you could just potentially just put a block there and put a block there. If you're scared, it might clog up and you still want people to see it. As you can see, it's washing all of these beautiful onions and it will come into the chest and now you can sell them for more money. Um, this update was probably the worst mistake Skyblock could have ever made. Um, and I'm also, I've also seen a bunch of scammers who scammed out one of my washing machines. It's just crazy. Crazy madness right now. Um, I'm gonna get more onion totems for my farm. And that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Be sure to drop a like and subscribe. As I said, we're about to hit 300, which will be my dream. But anyway, see you guys in the next one.